Taekwondo, the way of foot and fist, a martial art form that only some develop a jabbing passion for. That includes one Portland Haitian man. Taekwondo is what I like. I enjoy doing Taekwondo. Meet Fuenal Oste. He's president of the Haitian Taekwondo Federation and the founder of the One Taekwondo Academy franchise across the metro area. Now, he's kickstarting opportunities by leading a group of athletes representing Haiti to compete in an Olympic qualifying Taekwondo tournament. They have a lot of potential. There is a lot of potential. We are not sure if they're going to qualify, but I'm very convinced that every athlete will do their best and possibly uh, earn Haiti uh, that uh, qualification. Four of his students will be competing at the Pan American Qualification Tournament in the Dominican Republic on April 9th and 10th. For his students, they have been training and fighting for a chance like this for years. It's really exciting, you know. Um, also, a lot of nerves, of course, but I'm more excited than nervous. The last time Haiti qualified was in 2020 for the Tokyo Olympics. A technicality knocked them out of the competition. 2020 was the moment where Haiti athletes qualified at the Olympic Games by Alia Shipman. That was the first time a Haitian Taekwondo athletes qualify on their ring to earn that spot to go to the Olympic Games. But now, they're in the ready position to try again for a spot in the Games and give people a different perspective of Haiti. Haiti needs a lot of representation and especially with what's going on right now, I just want to somehow give back in a positive light. That's amid the current crisis where recent gang violence has set off due to changes in government. So all this chaos happening here, we want to do this positive light. So if we have good sports programs, we want to like bring out the positivity and think, just focus on the good stuff, not just like all the negative stuff that's happening. I had a chance to learn some moves from Master Funal Osta himself. Beautiful and dope. They can be as young as uh, three years old and as old, well as young as 99 years old. My current Right now, my current athlete, he's 74 years old. And while not everyone can be an Olympic athlete, these four hope for a chance for Haiti to compete and shine on the world's biggest stage this summer in Paris. So we want to hopefully we can make it to the Olympics, qualify and just like win. So we want to put Haiti back on the map. In Westland, Sabina Pierre, KGW News.